Talk about making a statement. It's shocking for people. Guys are walking taller, up to four and a half inches taller, thanks to the newest must-have accessory for men, high heels. What, three times the height of my heel? Yeah. It's following a trend that sort of started more in Europe. And now man heels are flying off the shelves across North America. This is one of the last pairs. It's a size eight. We have nothing across the company. These actually came out of our Quebec store because we sold out of our run within the first two weeks. Not surprising that the fellas appreciate a boost in height too. Total rock star, instant, like swagger. It's just fun to stomp around in them. Well, it was just a matter of time before men donned the heel. You see, it was the guys, not the girls, who first adopted the high heel back in the 1590s. And then us ladies followed suit. It was more a signifier of status. A way for the upper class to prove they didn't have to engage in backbending labor. Over the course of that 140 year period, it gets higher and higher and higher. It becomes increasingly big and blocky. Look at this. There was also that short comeback in the 60s and 70s. I think this one speaks for itself. Fast forward <laughs> to the present at Harry Rosen of all places. Prada's come out with a few different versions of a platform move the hand away and magic happens. Uh, here's the platform. They've even come up with a blinged out pair of elevated golf shoes. We have sold more than 24 pair. Of these? Of these. For 1400 bucks. Yeah. Ferragamo and Tom Ford are also stacking up. A client who's uh, on the conservative side who is height challenged, uh, they may want to use this elevated heel. Tom Cruise, Simon Cowell, Bono, even Francis Nicolas Sarkozy have secretly been getting a boost with them for years. Because it gives them a little extra and it's not noticeable. Get ready because men's shoes are inching up.